Sudan's army chief, Abdel Fattah al-Bakhan, has reiterated his commitment to a democratic transition, saying he will not be part of the new government after the transitional period. Al-Bakhan made remarks when he received a delegation of the Arab League for talks to resolve the country's political crisis. On October the 25th, the military seized power in Sudan, dissolving the government and a sovereign council. Protesters have continued to call for national strikes against the takeover. On Sunday, security forces fired tear gas at demonstrators. At least 13 people have been killed and more than 300 injured since protests began last month. Al-Bahan has denied the army is responsible for the deaths.